morning. I'm Diane and it's Tuesday, May 17th. Let's take a look at what happened today in Toledo history. It's 1910 and for the first time in 76 years, Halley's Comet is soon to be visible. A professor from St. John's College in Toledo speaks at Westminster Hall at Superior and Locust Streets. Many people believe the comet to be a bad omen that will bring wars and pestilence. Reverend Frederick Hillig reassures his crowd that the fears are baseless, saying that neither the death of King Edward nor the failure to build the Cherry Street Bridge could be charged to Halley's Comet. In 1916, the Overland Band performs a charity concert at Cold Burn Street United Brethren Church. A group of boys are denied entry and decide to spoil the show. The boys open a church window, turn on a hose, and escape. Police were told the concert spectators were soaked. In 1953, the newly built Fire Station 1 at Huron and Orange Streets opens in downtown Toledo. The headquarters would later be named after former fire chief Mike Bell. Bell was the first black man and the youngest person to lead the Toledo Fire and Rescue Department. He was appointed in 1990 and remained for 16 years before becoming state fire marshal and later Toledo mayor. And that's it for now. I'm Diane and that was today in Toledo history.